off the left side of Martinez and Messi off the right. They've got multiple ways they can kill you, and so much of it is about number 10 just being on the field. They've got a real good battery in front of them with Araujo and Cartagena, but I think this is about Angulo and Santos. To rip up the script and spoil the plot. Underway in the round of 32. Leafs Cup 2023, these two in-state rivals. Messi to Busquets. Kramaski, wide to Taylor. Taylor cutting inside. Clipping it, Messi! No stopping, Lionel Messi! Another early one for Inter Miami, who go up 1-0 behind the great one. It is remarkable to me to hear and see what Robert Taylor is doing with this opportunity. Grabbing the opportunity by the scruff of its neck, years ago playing non-league football in England, considering a different profession, this man shows up, He's got three goals, two assists, and he's living every person's dream playing with Lionel Messi. Great finish from Messi, but fantastic play from Robert Taylor. Akulo getting around Kramaski. Akulo in the touch from Calendar, and then in Aloha! Orlando responds. Cesar Try to defend that with Messi over here, bypass all of that and find Angulo on that near post. Now, Callender does a good job to react and make that save, but this does not happen if you're not aware of Angulo bypassing the initial pressure, pressure from Lionel Messi and good finish from Araujo in the right spot at the right time, giving Oscar Pereira in Orlando City the right reaction after a moment of brilliance from Lionel Messi, 1-1, game on. Trying to train at a high level by yourself in another country. Katie, you're asking the wrong person. I hate <laughs> training with anyone. <laughs> I was gonna say, with only yourself, that might be a dream. There is Yedlin <laughs> to Martinez. Oh, Messi! Oh, my oh, word. The post. Of contributing in the final third. I asked the question at the beginning of the year, can DeAndre Yedlin give anything in the final third for Inter Miami. Now with Messi and Martinez and Busquets and Taylor around him, Yedlin's going to create a ton of chances. Messi over the wall. Galese pushes it over the bar. This is so good from Galese, and I'm not talking about the save, but you've got to hold your post. Same spot. He went to the post where Brad Guzan was, dipped it up over him. You've got to force Lionel Messi. Who was given a yellow there? Kyle Smith for his reaction after the foul? I think for Smith. Or Ar uh, I think it was Smith for stopping the promising attack. He was the first to tug. Kramaski just wide. Robert Taylor. To Kramaski. He turns into space. Throw for Martinez, who goes down. Penalty given! Atlanta United was here, and this is where McVeigh brought down the Atlanta United attacker and was given a red card. Great little ball there from Kramaski. I just, I, I don't see it. Initially, I didn't see it. And after the second and third look, I don't see enough there from Antonio Carlos. He reaches back to find Joseph Martinez, but I'm not sure I see enough of a grab. Martinez, who has scored eight goals against Orlando in his career. We'll get this instead of Messi. Joseph Martinez scores! But that little stutter step, just watching Galese, does he move, does he lean? He goes to the left. 
Messi. See ya. Robert Taylor. Still Robert Taylor. Floats it towards Joseph Martinez. Settles. Messi! It continues to go perfectly. But Messi lands in Fort Lauderdale, and all of a sudden, Barcelona shows up wearing pink. Who is Robert Taylor? Where did he come from? The composure, the technique, the ability to lift the ball to the back post. And Joseph Martinez throughout his entire career has been the finisher, the lethal finisher. Yet in this moment, to take a little pause have a peek and set it up on a platter for Lionel Messi, his fifth goal. Halson sending it in. Miller back into the match, almost made it to Enrique. Penalty shot waved off by Ivan Park. Felipe, Torres, Rafael Santos drives it in, and it's put in at the back post. Ujo, you've got to be committed. You've got to see the back post is naked. Can you get there in the final moments? It's going to be very, very difficult, to, I think, to determine whether or not Enrique's in front of it. But he's going to have a second look because from our 18, and then he does play an impact of the, uh, of the goal because the dummy here forces Drake Callender. Looks very close to being behind the ball, but he is offside. The goal is taken away. As Calendar puts it back into play, and it is over. Messi's Miami magic continues.